Pakistan. So, I will start with these words. Allah Almighty says in Quran, Do not kill a person whom Allah has gave sanctity except rightfully. The reason for choosing this topic was present to highlight the importance of providing protection to human life in the light of Sharia. There is a dire need of istihad at present time to address the new day-by-day -day emerging problems. For example, the threat related to the protection of life of minorities. The meaning of minority is a group of people less in numbers than those who are in majority by religious belief, race or any other basis in any particular country or area. In Pakistan, nowadays religious minorities are facing violence and they are feeling very much insecure themselves. During previous five years, hundreds of the minorities have has been killed due to many reasons. If we realize the factual position of persecution of the minorities, we will observe that we, we will realize that the religious tolerance is decreasing in our country day by day. The demographical presentation of the minorities uh, residing in Pakistan is as shown in the pie graph. Green color is showing the Muslims and other colors are showing different minorities. The methodology utilized in this uh, research was qualitative and the interviews of the respondents were conducted in detail. Results are also presented by bar graph. Objective of these results, these research was to highlight the importance of Sharia and to highlight the uh, importance of the Ishtahad at present time and to find out the rules of Sharia to protection of human life, which is very much supreme. And research uh, and also I have focused on present situation of the minority rights in Pakistan with connection of the Janawala incident. The findings of is this research remains that the minority peoples has highlighted their problems and conclusion is uh, I reach at the conclusion that the minority members of our country are facing too many problems in various fields such as they are facing the problem in registration of their marriages, deaths and newborn childs then they are also facing the problem in uh, distribution of their inherited properties. They are also facing problems in jobs. Minority members are stated that, as stated that their children are facing problem in getting admissions in educational institutions. On conducting survey, it is observed that the government is sleeping over the right of the minorities in in shape of the Islamic law persecution project persecution on the name of the blasphemy laws, there is a hanging sword on the heads of the minorities. So the problems uh, which has been uh, uh, which has been told by the minorities are shown in, in this uh, bar graph and researchers recommend that till today from the creation of Pakistan laws are laws about the registration of married divorce of the minorities is not made Minority members are also facing problems in getting admission to education institution due to the fixed quota, and there is there should be a proper protection against the forced conversion of the religion, and the secured procedure should be established for the conversion as a forced conversion should be stopped. No separate law is present for the minorities' protection, on the which the implementation implementation should be ensured on the uh, additional to the constitutional articles adding a section in pakistan penal code act, uh, against the minorities violence against the minorities that makes sure for the religious minorities to get protection under the umbrella of the laws that the clearly uh, clarify the rules resolve the status of the statutory bodies such as the federal Syriac code and the council of islamic ideology as they have been misused by the extremists with the Pakistan state system to provide the legal cover to the discrimination and abuse and the word minority should be properly defined and called for an end to the discrimination in the name of the caste class creed and the set. There is a very high time to highlight the important need of the time to improve and strengthen the relationship with our minorities.
there should be no discrimination in educational institution for at uh, the time of the admission so rules should be made for the getting jobs in the public sector major major part of the minorities while population in pakistan is poor illiterate untrained the society should play a role in to improve their economic and educational conditions minorities are not allowed to join pakistan armed forces and police department on the context of the security this type of discrimination should be removed in it should be the seriously observed that the state remains fail to give justice to the minority minorities in pakistan in case of blasphemy blasphemy from a prompt action should be taken to avoid the worst situation and these steps i uh, recommend should be taken to safeguard the minority rights in pakistan legal reform should be made educational initiative should be taken integrate human rights and diversity education into the national curriculum to foster understanding and the tolerance for the early age from the early age and enhance uh, representation and the uh, assemblies and other uh, institutions preservation of the cultural and the religious freedom safeguard individual rights to practice their religion and preserve their cultural identity to take protective measures to protect religious minorities from discrimination and the violence socio economic programs uh, should be launched implement aff- affirmative actions programs addressing the socio economic this uh, dispar- disparities faced by the minority communities provide improve improved access to the healthcare education and the employment opportunities to promote educational equal participation in the society law enforcement and the judicial reforms also should be made conduct training programs for the law law enforcement and the judicial officials to enhance the sensitivity to need to minority communities ensure swift and the impartial investigation and the prosecution crime against the minorities promotion of the interfaith dialogue should be uh, encouraged and the facilitate interfaith dialogues to foster understanding and the tolerance among the diverse religious groups supportive initiative bringing together member of the different community for the constructive convergence and geos and the civil society should be involved encourage and support the active participation of the non governmental organization ngos and the civil society in advocacy of the advocating for the minority media responsibility promote the responsibility responsible reporting on the minority issues avoiding the per- Uh, perpetuation of stereotype or discriminatory narratives international collaboration should be enhanced collaboration and coll- collaborate with the international organization and the human rights bodies to share best practices and seek assistance in the implementing the minorities uh, man- monitoring the minority rights in the light of the quran and sunna i at the end i will recommend that our religion is very much clear about the rights of the human being and the human right, human life is giving super mercy all, at all over the things and also islamic law says that the murder of a person is murder of the whole mankind so i will that's all from my side allah hafiz and thank you very much